Hi everyone, today we're going to be taking a look at the Bandai Yellow Hornet figure. Now this figure has 14 points of articulation. And as you can see, this figure is really realistic and it looks absolutely terrifying. Um, the height of this figure with the stand see here is about uh, going by the top of the wing is about nine inches high uh, so this figure when you get it uh, it comes in gashapon machines which are toy vending machines in Japan and you don't know which figure you're gonna get there are three figures in the set um, they come in wrapped balls like this and when you open it uh, it comes with instructions there are about uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 pieces that you need to assemble this figure and the ball actually down here turns into a stand which is this stand here so this is actually the top of the ball and this plastic uh, stand is also part of the capsule packaging, which is pretty neat. So let's take a closer look at this figure. Uh, let me take it off the stand here. Oops. So if that ever happens, um, don't worry, it's not broken. Uh, all these joints here, they're on, um, they've got ballpoint joints like this, and you just plug them in back into a hole to wherever it fell from and it's okay so this figure the abdomen can move up and down so you can have it you know in a flying pose like this or if you want to have it where it's just standing on the ground have it like that you can see here the wings and move up and down or you can even move them around the neck also can do a 360 so you can freak out your friends by having this wasp you know talk to them upside down even the antenna has ball joints you can move them around and the mandibles uh, these things are scary so the mandibles actually can open up if you want you can put some fruits or vegetables in there give them something healthy to eat so also these legs can move around And the coolest part, if you can notice here at the bottom, so the abdomen actually can move up and down. And you notice how the stinger is missing, but actually the stinger is there. Um, what you would want to do is move your fingernail in between these little slits here. And there pops out the stinger just like that. So you can hide the stinger or you can pop it open, cool. So the stand here can help you to pose your figure. So the first pose I had the figure in was in the stinging pose. Like this. Now if you want to pose your figure in a flying pose so you'd want to detach it and this part here can also detach all right so I had it like this 
you can flip it up. So now you can put the figure like this on there. So he's flying and one of his antennas just flew off. Let's plug that in there. So yeah, so now you can have it pulse like that. So this is a real cool figure, lots of articulation, and it does look pretty real so you can scare the heebie-jeebies out of your friends or your family or your neighbor. So I'll put a link in the description where you can purchase this figure. And if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.